So Victoria is one of the most bike friendly cities in all of Canada with hundreds of kilometers of bike paths and today we are taking out some electric bikes thanks to Ride the Glide. We're going to show you the top 10 places to see uh, with electric bikes in Victoria. Number one, Victoria's waters, we're in the Inner Harbour, are the home to three resident pods of orcas or killer whales. Number two, the Empress, they serve 400 cups of tea here a day, half a million cups of tea a year here. Number three, the Parliament buildings. At night, you have to come at night, they light it all up, it's really beautiful. And there are 3,300 energy efficient light bulbs. So Emily Carr from 1871 to 1945 was incredibly avant-garde with her art and her monkey and her camper. And she did these beautiful landscapes and was inspired by the First Nations people. And we're gonna ride our bikes by her house too. While you're by the Empress and the museum and the legislature, come and check out the totem poles. The totem poles tell stories of First Nations people. There's a lot of construction around here right now and buses. And it's really interesting because actually only six clans of First Nations people are responsible for building totem poles. They're made out of cedar so that they don't rot. And I'm gonna link in the show notes so that you can find out more about them because it's super fascinating. Number six is Fisherman's Wharf with the float houses. It's super fun to come down here and walk around the float houses and have some fish and chips at the fish shop. It's a really cute place to come. Okay, number six is Ogden Point. So it's a really nice walk out this point. It's 1.6 kilometers or one mile round trip. Lots of people like to jog it because it's a nice measurement. And here we are at mile zero. It's in front of Beacon Hill Park. And this is where the Trans-Canada Highway starts. And it's where Terry Fox would have gotten to if he finished his cross country run of Canada. And it's just, every time I come here, I just get teary. I love this place. So Victoria, BC is said to be the perfect growing environment and every year they do a bloom count. In 2018, there were 3.4 billion blooms counted, billion. And uh, right now we're in Beacon Hill Park. It's a great place. There are bike paths you can uh, ride through here. Here in Beacon Hill Park, we have the tallest freestanding totem pole in the world. Number nine is Government House and the royal family and dignitaries are greeted at Government House and they stay here. And in 2016, uh, Prince William and Kate and their family stayed here when they came on their cross country tour of Canada and when they stayed in Victoria. Okay, number 10 is Craig Darrow Castle. And this is an example of the Bonanza Castle, something that was popular for entrepreneurs who made a lot of money in the industrial age. They would build these Bonanza Castles, which is super fun. 
Okay, here's your bonus, number 11, Canada's oldest Chinatown. So Government Street and Johnson Street has some great shopping and local shops. The dress I'm wearing today comes from Smoking Lily. It's a local shop. And we're gonna go over to Johnson Street and Trounce Alley to show you some shops too. Okay, so Fan Tan Alley is the narrowest alley in Canada and you definitely have to come check it out. And when you do, come have an ice cream at Kid Sister Ice Cream. So Johnson Street has some super cute shops, including Baggins, which has like the most ever Converse and Vans that I've ever seen in my whole life. Trounce Alley has one of my favorite shops, Shishi Bags, which has a great selection of mat and nats. So thanks so much for watching and give the video a thumbs up. Thanks to Ride the Glide for the electric bikes for the day and have fun on your uh, electric bike ride through Victoria, BC. Let us know uh, what kind of flavor of ice cream you had at Kid Sister when you go also, in the comments. electric bikes rule going up those hills. Oh my goodness, yeah, that, so is so, <laughs> that is so, so easy. So much easier. So much easier on the hills. Have a good day. Okay, Cheers. Bye.